<laughs> With summer just around the corner, who wouldn't want to escape to a private island? Are you looking at it right Carl? now? Well, now you can, Carlos, if you've got a cool 15 million bucks lying around. Oof. Tamana Island, just off Mission Beach in Queensland, is up for sale. And joining us to chat about this dream escape is real estate agent Steve Wiltshire. Good morning Steve. to you, Steve. Congratulations um, on getting this sale. It sounds pretty unique, but what is the vibe <laughs> on this island? Uh, the vibe is it's pristine. It's sort of beyond words, but <clears throat> you're sitting there listening to the waves lapping, the orchestra of birds and the smells of the blossoming rainforest. I mean, I could rave on, but uh, the words won't do it. Look, um, I went to and high school up there in Cairns and we used to go down to Mission Beach a lot. Uh, we never got across to the islands. Uh, what's on the island uh, apart from that beautiful tiny little beach there on the corner um, for people and what can they do with it? Well, it, it goes across behind the beach as a fairly flat area that has already got fruit trees and things growing in it. Um, it could be gardened up um, and then it rises steeply up to a hillock um, and it's covered in dense rainforest so you really don't need to do any landscape just uh, there's an old shack there that is in need of a lot of attention with strong bones as you, we say in the industry <laughs> <laughs> so it's a renovator's delight is what you're saying <laughs> that sort of thing it's a shack so yeah. so who's likely to be in the market for something like this who's you know showing some interest I think I'm looking at two people right now. <laughs> <laughs> um, With his money. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm happy to You're invest. Paying. I just um, I just wonder how hard it is for me to put a 10-bedroom house on it <laughs> and a bar. How, well, did, how do DAs go up there? <laughs> uh, simply, you can build a house, house there without any problem. Yeah. Beyond that, if it's anything to do with multiple dwelling or tourism, which it really wouldn't suit, It'll be ideal for a boutique thing, but mm. that's it. Um, it. It's just a cherished thing. I've lived here for 50 years, and it, it's uh, I'm buying lot of tickets like mad. <laughs> <laughs> um, I lived on Badara, I did live on Badara for a while, so I'm. I wonder. The reception's not great. That's pro that's yeah, probably perfect. one of the winning yeah, <laughs> features of an island like that, isn't it? Um, what a beautiful yeah. opportunity for someone somewhere. Yeah, Carl. and also, my man, uh, from that island there, you can see the, the little nudist beach over at Mission as well. <laughs> I mean, that's just an that's added right. bonus. Yes, <laughs> you're right on the mark. It's it's ideal for a wealthy hermit, really. Is the, <laughs> the main answer. Did you say a wealthy <laughs> hermit or pervert? <laughs> um, do <Hello>, wealthy hermit. <laughs> It's, and it's only <laughs> two and a half hours to an airport, oh, I love including it. the boat trip. Well, we are in, Steve. Uh, we, we love that kind of stuff. I mean, the island in general. Um, and you're a legend, mate, for coming on. Please let us know how it goes because it's what a, what a stunning yeah, keep us day. Updated, yeah. Oh, it's stunning a shame day. about the weather up there, isn't oh, it? Awful. <laughs> oh, it's terrible. Thank you, Stevie. Good on you, Good mate. Good on you, Steve. What a gig. Indeed. Hey there, Today fans. Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?